hello again and welcome back to my channel now i'm showing you here a sun change dip powder so it changes color in the sun from a peachy pink to a purple and because i've previously tried a glitter holographic glitter dip powder in resin when i made a um, oval trinket tray and that's still up for sale on my website if you would like it um, i wanted to see if this dip powder would work in resin and change color like it does on your nails in the sun so obviously this is more of a actual acrylic powder than the um, glitter dip one that i used but i still wanted to give it a go anyway so as you can see there i added two spoonfuls to my clear resin that was previously mixed and left for five minutes to degas which you know so that makes all the little tiny micro bubbles pop and you can see as i'm adding it it's going to more or less the same color as my background mat <laughs> a beautiful pink like peachy pink and just to give that a bit of extra um i mean you can see it's all mixed in beautiful there i'm gonna have to leave it to degas again but just to give it a little bit of extra bling because I was hoping to turn this into a sun catcher I'm going to be adding some um, pink it's called pink rainbow um, glitter so it's not actual a solid opaque color if I can get some focus nope there we go but it will just give that little extra bit of um pinky sparkle so i'm just going to add that and mix that in so i have no idea if this is going to work i have no idea if it is actually going to cure properly so you can see i hope there there's a bit of like iridescent sparkle I'm not sure if I want more sparkle so I'm going to oh no I thought I added a bit more sparkle maybe I didn't so there's my little coaster mold there that I use for my sun catchers I must admit this was actually a bit too much resin for a sun catcher I normally like them a little bit thinner but it is what it is and I just carried on scraping out the bottom I could have used a bigger circle coaster shape but it's you know it's still nice so just make sure that I get every little last drop out because I don't like to waste any resin and then I like to go around the edge with a cocktail stick just to release any bubbles that may be sticking to the edge outside ring because I don't want to see any bubbles when I take it out the mold and then go over with my clicky lighter to pop any bubbles and give it a spritz with isopropyl alcohol and leave it to dry okay because it's been so warm this cured a lot quicker than normal and you can see there the defect in the top it has cured completely i do believe that defect to be the actual fine acrylic powder that has just settled in the middle but watch this as i hit the sun just look at that color change a beautiful beautiful shade of purple like a pinky purple and then without tripping up if you watch as i walk back inside out of the sun it slowly fades back to its original color so i will add a another little top coat on top of that just to hide that defect because i just i'm not happy with that part of the coaster but i am happy with the um final piece so 
as you can see there just placed it back in the mold just to make sure and now all I'm going to do is I've mixed up a glitter top coat using pink rainbow and uh, um, I think it was rainbow sparkle I'm not sure I do actually show both of them here if we can get focus oh there you go colorful rainbow and rainbow pink just to cover that defect and give it an extra sparkly finish as I think this will make an absolutely beautiful sun catcher and can you imagine in the sun shines on it and it changes to a purple and then the sun goes behind a cloud it'll possibly go back to a bit pinky so throughout the day it just could be going one color to the other so I'm so happy that this worked so just carefully push that sparkly resin without overflowing it and just dome the top and then once that is dry, it will be ready to turn into a sun catcher. So yeah, I have other colours in the sun change dip. So now I know that they work, I can make lots of colourful items that change in the sun. Just give that a what's it with my lighter and leave it to dry. And yeah, so I'm glad it's covered that defect too. And then, as if by magic, it is completely dry. Just look at that beautiful sparkle. It's hidden the defect. It's still super pretty the other side too. Sadly, the sun's not out today, so I can't see. But I will post a video on my Instagram. But until then, thanks for watching. And I'll see you all later.